So let's talk about targets. Many people have spent a lot of time clicking around in Salesforce looking for the targets tab. Mm. <laughs> Don't waste your time. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't no, exist. It's not there. It doesn't exist. There are three ways to measure target in Salesforce, sales performance against target. This is by far and away the easiest one. It's included in the dashboard package. <coughs> Excuse me. It's included in the dashboard package. So this is a simple gauge. Um, it's a dashboard gauge, um, and it runs on a report of closed one opportunities. So this is running on um, uh, target um, pipe close one against uh, target for this month but it could run on the exact report that for this that is showing close one opportunity so this report is showing it for the year um, if we wanted a target for the year we could use the gauge here um, or we could just create that exact same report it's nice isn't it it's simple it tells simple. you it tells you whether you're going to hit your target you know no one wants to be in the red and you're all pushing towards that green and and I've known a lot of salespeople that love this because it's it is simple yep. but it's not without its downside, and that is the admin. <laughs> yes. Well, I think there's two downsides. I think admin, I agree. Yes. I agree. You, if you want to create this chart for every single salesperson, which you probably should do, then you've actually got to create an individual gauge for every salesperson. If the target varies from one month to the next, you've yeah. got to update the red and um, amber and green parameters. Um, if you want to target at the regional country or the company level or whatever it might be you got to create an individual gauge um, to do that it also doesn't really tell you anything about historic did we historically achieve target yeah. the other actually I haven't really thought about this but the other problem is that if I put it in for the year so if a target for the year then obviously February you know, January February March etc I'm going to be sort of down here in the yeah. doldrums somewhere so it's not particularly motivating from, no. from that point of view. on the other hand as Dan says simple is if you need a solution right this very second that's a simple way to do it yeah that's one way to measure performance against target um the second way to do it is to yeah. use the, the forecast, forecast tab. the forecast tab yeah um everybody will have access to the forecast tab will everyone uh, use it though gary the 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 problem with the the problem with the forecast tab yeah. is it is sophisticated but Maybe it's quite challenging to yes. use. Yes. I've seen a lot of people try to use the focus. You need to train the sales, but there's a real concerted effort um, to manage to performance against target using the forecast tab. Not desperately easy to implement, but if you can implement successfully, quite sophisticated. Yeah. The third way to do it is um, to use a custom solution. Um, we have an app called uh, the Target Tracker, which gets over some of the shortcomings in so much as it very gives you a very visible view of how you are performing against target for this month and for all of the how you performed historically but it also takes account of the pipeline because what this gauge doesn't tell you is well i might be let's say i might be here on the borderline in terms of what deals i've closed one for this month um but what about my pipeline there's still another two weeks to go so if i close 10%, 20%, what percentage of my pipeline do I need to close in order to achieve my target? So it gets around those issues. And it also helps for pipeline reviews by saying, well, okay, I've got, you know, I've got half my target sitting in my pipeline, but okay, what about the quality of the pipeline? So there's some tools in that app to um, help you do that. There's a video on our website. If you go to our website and look at the apps page, um, then you can look at the target tracker app and our other apps um, as well.